This is my NBA 2K20 Ultimate Creator Player Roster Creator Draft Class Wishlist. I'm going to start this off with the most requested feature for Draft Class and Roster Creators. And this is allowing us to upload face photos and put them on our created players, similar to how WWE 2K has for their game. Add more sculpting sliders and preset options for the forehead, the jaw, the eyebrows, the eyes, the mouth. Also allow us to make the heads bigger with the skull sliders. Right now, pretty much every created player has the same head size, even if we max out the skull sliders. Give us the ability to copy and paste preset slider changes of a created player with a press of a button to different head presets without resetting the facial structure changes. So on the screen, if you hit triangle, you'll copy the preset changes, meaning the nose changes, the lips, the ears, etc. And then if you hit square, you'll be able to paste all those changes onto a different head preset without having to input everything manually. Add more unique and realistic hairstyles and facial hairstyles that current NBA players have, especially a variety of dreads. If you need any ideas on hairstyles, just look at what the current young up and coming basketball players have. Add more realistic blemishing options that actually show in game. Right now, only one of the four options shows anything on the face. Also bring back skin discoloration that was in NBA 2K17. Let us combine the different facial hair options that we have in the game, similar to how it was in NBA 2K17. So for example, if I want to combine facial hair 5 and facial hair 8, we should be able to do that. Add a hairline slider in the hair section that lets us move the hairline up and down. So if I want a hairline like Chandler Hutchison or Paul George, I should be able to do that. And if I want a hairline like LeBron James, I should be able to do that as well. Add the color palette from the shoe creator into every mode in the game that allows you to customize. So that's for the eyes, the skin tone, the hair, the facial hair, the lips, the eyebrows, accessories, jerseys, and courts. The color palette tool lets us select the exact color we're looking for by allowing us to enter the RGB values that we get from Photoshop. Accessory colors are random when editing a player or rebranding a team. Let us manually select what colors we want for our accessories for home, away, and alternates using the color palette menu screen. Change the wingspan value to show the exact measurements instead of the current 0 to 100 slider. So if my player has a 610 wingspan, we should be able to move the slider all the way to 610. Add muscle tones to creative players. So give us the option to choose from slim, regular, ripped, or fat. And have each body type show some difference when changing the weight. We haven't been able to make a fat guy in 2K yet. Let us jump into freestyle mode by a press of a button while creating a player. So right now on the screen, I have it pressing triangle. Let's just jump into freestyle mode. This will allow us to quickly see how a creative player looks in game and test our jump shot. Add all the celebration after two and three animations from my career into the signature miscellaneous section and create a player. Also add all the my park dunks into the packages of dunks we get to choose from. We should be able to give our creative player some personality. If I want my guy to do the ice in the vein celebration after a three, we should be able to add that. Another highly requested feature is tattoos. We should be able to add tattoos on our creative players similar to how we are able to do it in my career. Add more nicknames for creative players and also give us the option to turn off nicknames. It could get annoying hearing the same nicknames Insanity, the great one, 80 times during one game. Overhaul the whole player DNA interface. Have it look like the team design section so we're able to preview faces and bookmark our favorite creators. Allow us to upload logos anywhere on the court. The court creator hasn't been touched since it was introduced and it's getting repetitive due to the lack of options we have. I would love to create the old Houston Rockets court, but we can't because of the limitations. Either give us more options or provide us with a Photoshop court template that we could customize and upload to NBA2K.com. Add more wood floor colors and patterns. Also allow us to create alternate courts and let us upload and download courts only in the team design sections with no jerseys attached. Give us more arena options to choose from. Indoor gyms and outdoor courts are already in the game each year. We shouldn't have to mod them from the PC into team designs for console users to use in my league. Allow more than 10 image slots in the jersey creator. Let us upload images for the home team crowd shirts. This NBA season was the first time ever players were able to wear sneakers of any color at any point during the season. The rule change allowed players to be expressive on the court with custom player edition sneakers. Allow us to do the same by adding image uploads for the shoe creator. Allow our created shoes to attach to our custom rosters and draft classes. As of now, if I was to create a roster with created shoes on a player, it would change the 2K's default shoes when someone else downloads the roster or draft class. 
Another highly requested feature is cross-platform rosters, draft classes, and player DNA. There are great creators on all platforms, but some players miss out on big rosters because of their choice of console. The team designs are already cross-platform, so rosters, draft classes, and player DNA should be next. A draft presentation update is needed. Right now, currently, the draft screen is boring and dull. I should be excited to have the number one pick. At least make the lottery draft picks unique. NCAA Football 2014 had an option to manage your online dynasty on their website. It allowed you to do everything you could do in-game besides play a game. 2K should take that idea and expand on it. Create a website that allows us to edit rosters and draft classes away from our consoles, whether that be on a computer, laptop, or a phone.